Welcome everyone. In this video, I'm going to go over a new capability in Amazon Macy that provides you with a one-click on-demand retrieval option in the Macy console to quickly investigate the data that was identified as sensitive from your Amazon Macy sensitive data discovery jobs. So let's jump directly into what this looks like in the console. Customers use Amazon Macy to discover sensitive data in their Amazon S3 buckets, and when sensitive data is found, they need to determine the priority and type of action needed on specific buckets and objects. You may take actions such as notifying the bucket owner, changing configurations of that bucket, or deleting that object. To help you prioritize, Amazon Macy generates findings which provide a severity rating, summary of the bucket's configurations, such as if the bucket can be accessed by anonymous users or if encryption was disabled for the bucket, and also a summary of the object's contents, such as the type, location, and amount of sensitive data found. However, Amazon Macy does not retrieve and store the actual contents of your objects in S3 to meet the compliance and security requirements of our customers. Thus, data security and data governance teams using Macy have asked for an easy way to extract which contents of an S3 object were identified to be sensitive so they can review, validate, and quickly take action where needed. Let's get started with our demo by selecting the Reveal Samples link under Settings on the left side of the screen. To enable this new Macy feature, it's as simple as clicking Edit. Then we can select Enable, and we'll specify a KMS key. As you can see, I already have one created. I'll then scroll down and select Save. And as simple as that, we've now enabled this new feature. It is important to note that all data captured with this new capability is encrypted using customer managed AWS KMS keys and automatically deleted soon after the examples are retrieved. So now let's jump to an account where I already have this new Macy feature enabled and have a finding generated. So as you can see, I previously run a Macy job and have a sensitive data finding, and we can see that by the name, we have multiple data identifiers that have found sensitive data. So let's click on this finding and use the new Macy feature to identify the types of sensitive data that was found. In the finding details page, we can see all the normal details we're used to. For example, we can see an overview of the finding sensitive data types that were found, like financial information and personal information. We can also see the S3 bucket that was affected. Now under the sensitive data section, we can see that there is a review samples section uh, with a link the, under the word review. If we're a data engineer, we might want to dive into the data further to confirm and investigate. So if we click this link, we're brought to a page that shows finding details and then a section about the sensitive data that was found. We can see the category of data type. So for this object, we had personal and financial information. We can also see the finding types from each category. For example, US social security numbers, date of births, and credit card numbers. So now let's click on the review samples button on the right side of the page. This will show us samples of the actual data found. With this information, we can confirm that there are actual social security numbers and phone numbers in the our S3 object. Now that you've confirmed the data is in fact sensitive, you can follow your standard procedures for remediation. In this video, I went over a new capability in Amazon Macy that provides you with a one-click on-demand retrieval option in the Macy console to quickly investigate the data that was identified as sensitive from your Amazon Macy sensitive data discovery jobs. This feature will enable data security engineers who design and develop the tools and processes to secure their organization's data, the ability to investigate incidents when data is mishandled, work closely with individual developers and application teams to encourage data security best practices and drive compliance requirements across the business. If you're interested in learning more about Amazon Macy, please visit aws.amazon.com slash Macy.